Hello, all havoc here. All right, so um, I played around with some audio settings, so I'm hoping today we get game audio and no shenanigans. So if there's shenanigans, I'm sorry. I'm still trying to work on it. Uh, that the list of things I have done and the hours I <laughs> literally hours I've spent trying to fix this is um, pretty drastic. Okay, so uh, comments from a few episodes ago. Haven't had a chance to bring those comments forward. Um, we're going to name this bad boy the B70. It was a B60. We've overhauled it. to B70 now. So that was one of the comments. I agreed with it. Uh, it's a good name because B60 stuck. Uh, it, it had been here, well, for a while. So we're going to go with B70. And you know what? It's a paint job. How do, no, I don't like that color, actually. That look like seafoam green. Uh, no. Let's go with the plastic. I'm really liking the plastic. Oh, mint green. That's really mint. And I don't mean, like, minty fresh. Oh, jeez, no, that's got to go. Um, where are we going with this? And basically, you can see that thing from, from Earth. That's like, that's crazy. Uh, let's get over to this little salmon color. No, no, nope, not down with that. How about fire orange? A legit orange. How about it? What? All right. Okay. That's kind of like Ember's color almost. For those of you who don't know, Ember's a ship that I've used for many, many, many seasons. Yeah, I like it. We take that, throw a touch of this on here. Do some racing stripe kind of action. Yeah, I'm liking it, I'm liking it. If I can do this without messing up, that'd be great. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna leave that orange. Yeah, I like it. Do those in blue. Yeah, go with this. Okay, and then outside of the bobs, yep, yeah. coming back, back around. Can I get through this without making a mistake? What is happening right now? Whoa. All right, so uh, B70 with the new paint job. Let's do that in here too. Right down the middle, right down Broadway. Oh, oh there was a mistake. All right, I'll take one. That, that was, I'll take one. Not bad. Let's paint. Get over here to that orange. Orange sickle. Boom. Done. Uh, let's put that at the blue too. I kind of liked the med base sticking out. There. All right. Yeah, buddy. Okay, I like it. I like it a lot. All right, so today's episode, um, yeah, I got a few things I want to get working on. I, I, I want to print this. Um, and you're probably all thinking I'm talking about B70, but I'm not. Probably the most requested thing to get printed the entire season. The entire season, like, uh, I, yeah, I can't think of anything that's been requested to be printed more than this one thing. And I think I'm going to get it started. Because one, it's going to free up a ton of space. 
<laughs> the amount of inventory space that I'm going to free up by printing this one item is just going to be... <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's, it's going to be nice. And um, so, yeah. Uh, naming containers, that was a comment from last episode. Yes, that needs to happen. I'm going to wait till I get Izzy's turret back on for that. But it is definitely going to make things so much easier if I did that. So, um, let's see. One of the other things was asked was, why is my opacity so high? Fix it, Havoc. Uh, let's see. Graphics. Field of view. Gross density. Um, why can't I change my... I can't change that when I'm in here. That's obnoxious. Can't change it here. Is that under game? UI. There we go. Okay. Opace, opacity. No. Background opacity. There we go. I shouldn't have messed with this one. I don't know what this one is. Um, I don't see it changing here, so that's kind of frightening. Okay, so let's go with that, and let's see what happens when we get over here. Okay, so I think this will do. Hopefully that will uh, appease the individuals, the peoples that be. Is that a terminal that works? It is. <laughs> um, yeah, we have a power problem. That was like one of the things that was commented in last episode was, hey, you guys are doing good on power. No, I'm not. <laughs> I'm not doing good on power. Can you tell? Because it all just shut down. Which means I'm actually defenseless right now. Mm -hmm. So that just happened. Can a wind turbine work on the moon? Like, there is some atmosphere, right? I can't believe it's taking this long for it to take that one bucket apart. Um, yeah, I can't see. So you guys can't see. I like panels, grab all of them. And we're going to do maximum effort. No all fall off, maximum intensity, offset maximum, blink interval. No, I'm kidding. Uh, I need to connect so we can charge the base using B70. So it's right here. Uh, cameras on connectors, totally a thing that I should do more often. I also like trying to do, to actually like connect, like it just did, and the base turns back on. Okay. So what's going on right now is everything's refining and uh, not getting any uranium over to here. So if I get in here, go here. That doesn't connect. That doesn't connect. I saw some in here somewhere. Nope. Nope. So if they would connect, they wouldn't be a thousand uranium over there uh, because it's not connected yet. That would be why Havoc. I'm trying to pull stuff across the network that isn't connected. I'm such a dork. Okay, let's get rid of you, 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 and you. ingots uh, not one not point one not point five 
like that much. No, yes. Okay, 2,000 uranium. That should get us running. Okay, almost 3,000. Why isn't this working? There's 27 uranium right there just chilling, and it's not going anywhere. It's like use conveyor turned off or something. Show on HUD, lock tools. Okay, can't do that with containers. Cool, that's good to know. Um, this is an advanced rotor, because if not, I was, I was literally about to cry. Um, so that's all green. That's con good to hear. Uh, it does. Did I not put the ports up and down? I don't know how to check that without destroying everything I've built here. Okay. So let's do it this way. You are a reactor. Um, you, sir, are... This is a Warframe battery. I need to get to that. So we're going to go here, here. Uh, test them. Don't judge me. All right. Here... Okay, inventory. I should have done this. My bad. Okay. Okay. You can get somewhere in here. There's like 2,000 of them. There it is. It works. Why? Comment down below. Tell me why these reactors are not pulling like they're supposed to be. Oh my goodness. Um, okay, so large reactor. Okay. So the two wings aren't connected. I'm fine with that. That's design flaw on my part because I haven't actually taken the time to hook the two up. Got it, right? But it boils down to why didn't this one set, this branch, start sucking up this uranium and keeping the base alive? This is frustrating. Inquiring minds want to know. It's not even a sub. Well, I guess it is a subgrid thing, huh? Hmm. All right. So I might need to do something about this if this is going to perpetuate. So I can come over here now. Uh, I'm do. that. So this entire bank of reactors should be online. And it is. No more power problems, and that means all our refineries should be just chilling and... Yep. Because I came over here earlier to test audio, and uh, <laughs> didn't have any popping crackling. The worst case scenario has been over in that spot. But now, the reactors aren't doing anything funky. So, okay. Now return to reschedule program. I wanted to print this. Um, so let's get nine, undock, move back over here. Ooh, uh, let's move over here. Okay. Perfect.
Okay, so I now I need I got the uh projector set up. Alright, hang on. So I need to go to one of these blocks here. I'm going to get rid of you and you. I added a mod. And it's the mod that adds the long tubes. Yeah. This needs to be a thing. So I wish they were on... Wait, are they on? A multi-block? Like... Or in they... Oh, they're in those. Okay, so I'll just keep the fives on there and then I'll get the smaller increments from inside of there. That's... Perfecto. Bien, bien. Okay. So you, you, fold it. Six. No. Grab it. All components were successfully withdrawn. No, they weren't. Liar. Okay, let's try that one more time. Cannot withdraw small tubes. That's fine. There it is. That's not gonna work. Oh wait, if I do... I don't believe it. Yeah, see. Um... So here, here, why am I not getting, thank you, projector, name, projector, this, oops, caps lock, it's gone with it, okay, all right. Projector this, blueprints, this. You thought I was kidding, I wanted to print this. <gasps> oh, I was about to do a thing that was gonna just totally ruin my life. Whew. Okay, so yeah, I was about to cry if that would have happened because that thing almost just did happen. So you guys, I'm just going to power you guys down. So until I get a proper place to dock you guys, that's probably the best bet. A bunch of lifeless buckets down here. And yeah. How are we doing? Are you guys off? Yep, all off. That's off. All right, you guys want to see what this is? <laughs> okay. Don't have to yell. Blueprints. Uh, blah, 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 could cause ship to split. Yep, sure. Guys ask, why don't I use mods? That's why. Uh, show only buildable, keep projection, uh, forward offset. So nothing's buildable, that doesn't work. So show only buildable, turned off. Okay. Uh, can't see. Oh, but, yeah, okay, there we go. And then we're going to, no, put that back. Still can't see, so we're forward offsetting again. Still can't see. I think it's upside down. I think it's right side up. Okay, so now I just need to do... 
Nope, that's not right. Ah, okay. No shenanigans. Here it is. You guys asked for it. It's the carrier. So it it, it had a place in this season. So uh, and now it's gonna get printed. So will it fit? No. It's close. I mean, it is really close. So uh, we're gonna have to turn pitch, yo, y'all, yo, yeah, that. It's gonna be pointed towards the ceiling. Okay, so. Uh, yes. Oh, it's not a slider. Okay, let's go back to zero. Okay, and now we want to yaw. Oh, that's a slider. That's not fire. Okay, so no. No. Roll. Yep. That's the stuff. Okay, so now we need to go with the ver verticality of it. Maximum effort. Yeah, actually, maximum effort. Cool. And now forward offset, bring it back home. Bam. Too much. Okay. <laughs> uh, this is going to be crazy. Uh, let's do some horizontal offset. Just a little bit. Yeah. Thinking of something about like that. Because that's like embedded. That's not so much embedded. Done. There we go. Right click. Uh, so I was connect going to connect it right there. Um, Oh, geez. <laughs> uh, some more horizontal offset and bring it towards... Oh, geez. Okay. Uh, here, here. Come on. I'm still learning this. Okay, so we're bringing this over to here. Back where it was. And then forward forward offset a little bit too much no no I think we're good how's the other side like yeah we're good so uh, the reason I want to connect it here is because see this right here this is how we were feeding it in the other series so yep that's how we're gonna feed it again so seven Let's go with eight so it matches. And um, so now we're gonna do we're gonna do straight up. I should have checked that. I know better. There could have been ice in there. Where are we going? Oh we got a long ways to go. Okay. Long ways. It's three pipes. All right, five, we're just gonna throw some shenanigans on there. Just whipping this out real quick, like. No way. No way. This is just gonna work. Please, just, just. Ah, oh, dumb, no. okay. It, that did line up though. It's just that I have to break out the three. Yeah, that's the three-er. You should be weldable? Yes, you are. Oh! I need interior blades. You know what else I need? All bobs activated.
You too, sir. Back in operation. All right. So obviously this is going to take a minute, like legit. It's going to take, this is going to be uh, quite a few. There. So I'm going to move over here just a smidge so I can continue to, hold on a second. I know why this Bob's taking forever to disassemble this bucket. This bucket's repairing itself. <sighs> oh my gosh. Like, man, this thing's taking forever to, to just disassemble this thing. Can, can we just get through this already? No, uh, no, not, not at all. It, it's just going to take an absolute eternity. So, uh, yeah. It's mostly here. This is, you, you guys kept asking, why am I not using XYZ mod and this and that? And because if I miss a mod, it's not going to operate. This behemoth of a thing is just not going to work. But um, some of the mods didn't load. I don't, because I didn't use them. Like the, uh, what you call it, the atmospheric thruster things that go here. Obviously, this has got to get turned back. Um, so that's why they're not there. So I'll have to figure something out for this. I'll probably turn this into a pod bay or something. I'm not sure. But uh, Battle Barge is... This thing's not big enough to carry a Battle Barge. It's big, but Battle Barge is huge too. So if we go in... Oh, here. Uh, F10. It has 18,635 blocks with a couple few mods in there, but it's all mostly here. Uh, and it's just going to take, like I said, an eternity to get it all printed out. All right. Well, with that, we're going to wrap up the episode. I uh, hope you guys have enjoyed the episode and the outcome of what is to come with this beast. Yeah, so we'll get this guy. You guys wanted me to cover up this hole. Um, this guy can go up, turn around, flatten out, and... Yeah, nothing's going in there. <laughs> for sure. Thanks for being here. Comment down below. If you haven't yet subscribed, we're shooting for 5K by the end of the year. And you guys make that happen. This is Havoc. Have fun, and keep gaming.